Hello everyone, episode 7 and 8 of The Impossible Air takes viewers on a heart-pounding ride filled with shocking twists and turns. Taeho finds himself in a horrifying situation, framed for the murders of Inju and his mistress. With his memories wiped clean and all evidence pointing towards him, Taeho is sentenced to death. But who is behind this elaborate scheme? Inju lures Taeho to his club under the pretense of Haiwan being held captive. Waking up drugged with amnesia, Taeho finds himself in a murder scene. Inju and Bona are dead, and he's the prime suspect. Sensing an opportunity, Inha coldly discards Taeho, seizing the moment to claim Taeho's position within the Kangho Empire for himself. Mijuan's damning testimony against Taeho seals his fate, sentencing him to death. This devastates not only Taeho but also Jungmu, who remains steadfast in his belief of Taeho's innocence. However, the horrifying truth comes to light, Inha, the seemingly loyal friend, is the architect of this entire conspiracy. In a calculated move, Inha orchestrated the murders of Inju and his mistress Bona through Mijuan, his pawn for years. Their connection stretches back 22 years, to when a 10-year-old Mijuan came to live in Inha's villa after her mother's tragic hit-and-run death. Inha, it seems, had been cultivating his own weapon of deceit for over two decades. From their respective trusted men, Taeho and Jungmu, get to know about Inha and Mijuan's history, revealing Inha's conspiracy to them. The fateful night takes a shocking turn as it's revealed that Taeho and Haiwan's connection goes beyond a kiss. Inha, enraged by the revelation of their affair, lashes out at Haiwan with a violent confrontation. He accuses her, do you know why I chose you? Because Taeho wanted you. This outburst exposes Inha's twisted logic. With her secret exposed, Haiwan makes a bold move. Recognizing a common enemy, she proposes an alliance to Taeho. Taeho who is already heartbroken by Inha's conspiracy against him, readily agrees. While Haiwan seeks control of the Kangho group, Taeho's sole focus becomes dismantling Inha's web of deceit. Following Taeho's suggestion, Haiwan approaches Jungmu, requesting control of the foundation. To everyone's surprise, including Inha, Jungmu grants her request. This unexpected development throws a wrench into Inha's plans and sets the stage for a thrilling power struggle. Following his instincts and with the help of a determined spy, Taeho uncovers a crucial piece of evidence, a fourth person was present on the night of the murder. This revelation is Roy, Mijuan's trusted confidant. Inha, threatened by this new development, orders the elimination of both Roy and Taeho to silence them permanently. Unaware of the deadly trap set by Inha, Taeho is lured into a meeting. As he walks into the unknown, viewers are left on the edge of their seats, wondering if Taeho can escape and expose Inha's crimes. Inha, hot on the trail, closes in on Taeho's mole. A tense encounter ensues as he seeks the truth. What do you think? Do let me know in the comment section below. If you like this video, like, share and subscribe. See you in the next video. Until then, take care.